What's the best thing about roast pork? The gravy. Here's how I make it. Put your pork roast on a rack in a roasting pan and add some stock to the pan. That liquid will catch your dripping so they don't burn on the bottom of the pan. If that liquid runs low while the pork roasts, add more so the brown bits dissolve into it. When the roast is done, pour that liquid into a fat separator like this one. Then add more stock to the pan to deglaze and scrape up any brownings. Get all that meaty flavor. The fat rises to the top of the separator jug and the spout only takes from the bottom. Scoop out four tablespoons of the fat or use butter if you don't have enough. Whisk in four tablespoons of flour, add one to two tablespoons more for a thicker gravy. Slowly whisk in the dripping from the bottom of the separator, keeping it smooth as you go. I season with poultry seasoning, which has tasty herbs like thyme and sage. You need about three cups of drippings total. If you had less from the roasting process, make up the difference with more chicken stock. There it is, rich and flavorful. Get ready to pour it all over the pork and mashed potatoes. And then tell me, what's the best thing about roast pork? It's the gravy, right? If you want this gravy recipe and more delicious gravy and roast recipes, head over to cookthestory.com. I have everything you need for the most delicious roast dinners ever.